So it's Sunday evening and I'm just sitting down to look at my planner for the week. I really like this spread. I like how this one turned out. And since I'm doing it after the pen this week, I'm going to be filming what I do every day. Uh, the last few after the pens have been sped up versions. This one's going to be a talk through because I know that about half of you like the talk through and half of you like the sped up version. So I thought I would talk through this one since I've been doing the speed up ones lately. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is just look at my calendar on my phone and fill in the things I have going on for the week down in these little boxes. So the first thing I have is tomorrow I'm going to be filming the Spiced Chaos podcast, which I'm super excited about. I'll let you guys know when that airs. And I'm so that's at, I believe, 2.30. And I said filming. Of course, I meant recording. So I'm just going to write that in right here. Let me take my glasses off because I cannot see with them close up. I know my eyesight is terrible, you guys. It's horrible. But okay, so of course, right away, it's not working. What is my pen doing? probably going to go over this with a paper mate. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to go over that with the paper mate flare because I want that to be a little bit thicker. And now since I did spiced in that font, I'm going to do chaos in cursive. I like to combine just printing and cursive just for interest. Whoa, what is that age? Oh, well, let's leave it in. <laughs> Um, and then I'll just write, I'll take a, actually a thinner pen and write podcast down there. Let's see. I like to combine thicknesses of pens every time I do it, do this. I think it just makes it a little more interesting. Podcast. 2.30. Okay, so that's the first thing I've got going on. Let me check my phone and see what else I have going on. I obviously have the gym and I have work, but I might add smaller boxes for those depending on what else I have happening this week. Let's see. Okay, Wednesday, whoops, Wednesday, I have... I'm going to this place called Longwood Gardens near me and going with my parents and their friends and my kids. And then Thursday I have a haircut and then Saturday my daughter Kaylee comes home from Missouri. So super excited about that. What is going on there? Let me take a glue pen and just glue this down. It just popped up. So, I am going to write that Kaylee comes home, and I'm going to do it in like the same type of pattern as that one on Monday. Now I've got Longwood Gardens. And then I have a oh, haircut. Why is there a piece of washi tape on this page? Oh my. So now I think I'm going to do smaller boxes for work and for the gym and kind of put them among the other boxes. Okay, I'm going to fill out my random acts of kindness for the week. I decided to do this because I saw this little sticker and I thought it would be fun and just a really nice thing to do around the holidays. So 
let me go ahead and fill that out. Okay, so now that I've filled out that section, like I said, what I'm gonna do is put little boxes in for the gym and for work. So let me get, let me see, let me get this book out. This is the, well, the rainbow sticker book. It's the big mega book. And um, I'm just gonna take a few of these and kind of place them around the page in the different colors that I need. I'm gonna stick within this color scheme. So let's get a green. It's not the same green, but that's okay. And I'm gonna put this one here. So I need one on Tuesday, one Thursday, one Saturday, a Wednesday and a Friday. So I need boom, 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 okay. How about a yellow, maybe a blue here. Let's do a blue there. I'm still gonna need one on this day. How about a pink here? Okay, now that those are down, I'm just gonna write in what I have going on. Okay, now I am gonna get a little payday sticker because payday is Friday. So let me just grab my budget sticker book. Um, I could use the new one, but I have that old budget sticker book that, like I hardly ever use stickers from this book. So let's pull out one of these. I'll grab a payday sticker. And put it here on Friday. Okay. Now I am just going to, I've got a lot going on this week as far as things I have to do. So I'm gonna leave these three boxes blank because number one, I might get plans. And if I don't, I'm gonna fill them in with other things like maybe what I'm reading or a quote or like really anything that I can think of to fill those in, um, like a doodle or something. So I'm gonna leave those blank for now and you'll see me fill those in during the week. But since it's Sunday, I'm just going to write a whole, I have like a lot of room for these to-do lists at the top of the page, like too much room, but I'm gonna go ahead and put in like first my YouTube to-dos and then just other things that I randomly have to get done during the week that I've been actually really procrastinating about. So I need to put those down and hopefully I can be a little more productive this week than I've been lately. So here's what I did, and you can do this sometimes. This sometimes helps my brain. So what I did was break my to-do lists out into sections. So this is cleaning to-dos. This is phone calls and texts I have to make, stuff I have to buy. This is Patreon. If you have not watched my Patreon video, I started a Patreon. So I posted that this week, so check that out. Um, these are things I have to do for YouTube and then these are online things I have to do. I left one extra box over here um, just for extras that I have that I like find during the week. I really like this setup. I may start doing this more often because like I said it's sort of helping my brain to organize it into categories 
And then like if I want to sit down and make phone calls, all my phone calls are right there instead of scattered around my page. So I'm going to maybe start doing that. I don't know. Um, so Sunday is over, like I'm done with the Sunday thing. This is all I'm going to do for right now. And then I'll be back tomorrow to do a little bit more with you guys. So see you then. Hey guys, it's Monday evening and I'm just sitting down in my planner to just check off a couple of things that I got done today and also write a couple of more things in here. So I'm just going to check stuff off. I still haven't made my phone calls, you guys. So bad, right? Well, I didn't get a whole lot done today, but I got a little bit of stuff done. So now down here, I am just going to, oh, here I'm going to put a reminder to myself to ship eBay because I just sold something on eBay. So I just want to write that in here. All right, so that's kind of dark, so I'm gonna to have to do like something else dark over here so that it kind of balances it out. And here I'm going to write down to ship Stitch Fix, and I'm not, I know I'm gonna be doing it tomorrow, but I wanna put it big so I'll see it. So I'm just gonna do that here. And if you're not familiar with Stitch Fix, I'll put a link to a, um, I'll put a link in the description box where you can get $25 off your first Stitch Fix box, which is a really good deal. Um, and basically it's a personal stylist where they send you clothes in the mail and then like you, they get to kind of know your style. They send you clothes and then you can pick and choose what you want and then just throw the others in a bag and throw them back in the mail. I just stick it in my mailbox. Um, and then like you can like it, it just helps you pick out styles you might not normally have chosen in the store and try them on and it's really fun to get clothes in the mail so if you're interested in that the link will be down there like I said $25 off so you really can't beat that um, so I'm going to go ahead and write that in here so I know that doesn't look great but it's good enough um, I did record the Spiced Chaos podcast today. Super fun. So if you don't know what this is, it's a kind of a planner podcast, kind of not. More like a, there are a couple of planners. They chat and they have guests on the show and everything. So today I was the guest and they are Spiced Chaos, uh, not Spiced Chaos, Spiced Plans and Creating Chaos. That's their YouTube and Instagram names. So check them out. They're really nice women and we had a really great conversation and that will be airing tomorrow, tomorrow, no tomorrow. Oh my God, I'm like losing my mind. That will be airing next Monday, the 23rd. So when you see this, I think it'll probably be Saturday. So in a couple days. So check that out. You can find it on Spotify. Um, and it's a really good podcast, and if you want to hear me talk to them about all sorts of different stuff, um, stay tuned for that. All right. So, trying to decide what to do with the space up here because, like, I might need to write in it, but like today I don't because it's like the end of the day. So, I don't know what I want to put there. Like, let me look in the Christmas book. Maybe there's like stickers I could put in there or something just to fill up that little area there. Let me just see. I don't have to fill that up, obviously, but I kind of, if you know my planning style, you know I'm kind of like a busy planner, so I like to fill up most, like not all the white areas, because I like to definitely have some white left over, but I don't know. It's just fun to make it look really busy looking. I like the busyness of it anyway. 
I'm just going to put some little stickers in each day. So this is like a little holly thing. And then tomorrow it might be something else. And I'm going to write in actually up here that Allie and Heather are home today. So that's it for today. I'll see you tomorrow. Hi guys, it's Tuesday and here I am back in my planner. It's the afternoon and I just wanted to write down a couple of things for today. So today I started my Patreon. I don't know if you saw that video, but I started a Patreon account and what it is is a way for me to connect you guys better and you get you would pledge a little bit every month and then you get extra special content from me. So the link is in the description box every for every video now. So if you want to check that out, go down there to click that link. But I wanted to mark this in my planner because it's a special thing for me because I worked really, really hard setting up this Patreon account. So I am just going to write Patreon launch. Actually, I'll put this in with my paper mate flare. And I'm just going to do like a really wide kind of font here. Patreon. And I'm going to switch to the Pentel Energel and just do this in cursive. Okay. So I'm just going to check off a couple things up here that I did. I'm going to check these again that are kind of light. I don't know what was happening with that other pen. I still have not made my phone calls. What is wrong with me? It's driving me crazy. It's very easy to make phone calls and I just don't do it. I don't know if you guys are like that. It's so annoying. Um, okay, so that is it for today. I'll be back on here tomorrow for more fun. Hello, it is Thursday and yesterday was honestly so busy that I did not even have a chance to look at my planner and I'm going to tell you about it. So first things first, I had a date Tuesday night that I need to mark down. It was kind of a last minute thing um, and in case you're wondering how it turned out, not well. <laughs> so I'm just going to write where I went, but the... God, that just that's not a good pen. The guy was I, I met him online and he um, first of all like I walked in to the restaurant and walked up to him and I smelled him like so far away because he had so much cologne on it and I am so turned off by that. So did not like that. And then he proceeded to talk about his ex-wife for two hours um, and how they still have a thing for each other and how it's confusing and he doesn't know what to do. And like, I wanted to say, dude, do you know you're on a date right now? <laughs> it was so funny. Um, so yeah, I'm not going to see him again. So skip to the gym. I have been so bad. I haven't been in like a week and a half. Oh my gosh, not good. And I'm starting to feel my back is like feeling like it's going to tweak because if I don't go to the gym a lot, my back doesn't feel good. And then yesterday, um, well, first of all, let me put a snowflake in because it did snow yesterday. So I'll put that in because it was nice. We went to Longwood Gardens which is a garden place around me and they have like Christmas lights and they have music playing. It's like a big, huge place you walk around and it started snowing. So it was really cool. Um, should I put it down here? Yeah, I'm going to put it down here. So it snowed and it was just flurries, but it was really, really pretty. So I was starting to mark that down and I'm just going to write in snow. Okay, so, but what happened yesterday was my car died, so, <laughs> yeah, I came home from work, like, it was hard to, t 
turn on at work. It was like, rrr, 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 rrr. and then I came home and I shut off the engine and I tried it and it did not work. So I had to then take my car to the shop today. So I'm just going to put this in here or maybe I shouldn't. Should I put one there? Um, I'm going to have to put one here too. Let me think. I'm just going to write that in there. So I'll write in car died. Boo hoo. Not cool. But I got it fixed. And $600 later, it's okay. Actually, it was just the battery, but then I needed brakes. And... Um, inspection and all of that so $600 later I have in case you're wondering what I drive I don't know why you really need to know that but I drive a Nissan Juke which is like kind of a little crossover thing I love it I've had it since 2014 it is my favorite car I've ever had love it love it love it but they don't make them anymore so I'm gonna drive this one into the ground I've got my Dunkin Donuts iced coffee here keeping me caffeinated for my video. Okay, so there's nothing here. So I don't know, what do I wanna do there? Oh, I wanted to write down that we went out for Thai food after Longwood Gardens. Um, just gonna put an arrow. And that was so good. I had the best green curry I have ever had. Oh my gosh, was it delicious. I had it for lunch today too. I'm just gonna write in green curry because I wanna remember to get that next time because it was so good. I usually get the Penang curry, but this one was better and spicier. So had some wine, some curry, some laughs. We had a good time. So up here, since there's this little space, it looks like the perfect space for like a washi kind of strip. So let's look in the winter book. I should probably look in the Christmas book actually. These colors really aren't. Oh, and I got the snowflake from the winter book. Let me look in the Christmas book because the colors will match if I do like a little washi thing. I don't know if they have those in here, I forget. Oh, they do. I could do like a little, well, this is too much pink. Coffee and shopping weekend. Cute. Family gathering, yes, but not enough room. Here we go. So we have these little guys. That might work. Let's try that. I was gonna put a red one in, but there's red here and red kind of there, and there's pink there, so I like the contrasts. So let's just use green. So basically what this does is just fill up that space a little bit so that it's not so much white compared to the rest of the spread. Do you know what I mean? Now I just need to find an X-Acto knife. All right, so that's that. That matches that pink really well. So let's put a pink one up here. Okay, so I got my hair cut and colored and guess what else happened? I skipped to the gym. Don't lecture me. Okay, so this I, I'm going to put my car appointment and I'll just do this in italics just to vary the lettering a little bit. Inspection. 
Then I'll just put in, I don't really need to put in the time because I already went, but might as well. Okay, so got that done. And then down here, I want to put that Allie and Heather and I finished painting the living room and we put up our new rug, which was very hard because I have a really, really small house and it was difficult because um, we had to move all the furniture in order to put the rug down and everything, but there was no place for the furniture to go. <laughs> so all the stuff's like on top of each other and we kept having to like move it a little bit and then move the rug a little bit, then move it a little, it was like a nightmare, but we got it done and it looks really pretty. Maybe I'll post a picture. Okay, so I want to put something about it here. Finished painting. And why does this pen not work? This one's better. I didn't put up the new rug, laid down the new rug, but it doesn't, that sounds weird, so. Okay. So tomorrow, um, I work nine to three, and then I'm going to see play with my friend. So I, I'm gonna write that in here, I guess. And we're going out to dinner, so. All right, um, what else tomorrow? I don't know what else, so I'm gonna leave this blank up here. Let me see if I've gotten anything else done at the top here. I'm almost done Christmas shopping, so I'm gonna check that off. Guess what, have I made my phone calls? No, I have not. But I did change the litter. I haven't cleaned upstairs yet. Um, I did not pay the bills yet. I did email the invoices for sponsorships and filmed newbie video. I'm gonna check these off even though I didn't do these, but really I, I'm, I would cross them out because I decided not to do that this video this week, but um, I don't wanna cross it out because it'll look weird in my planner. I like to like, keep it looking all the same. So that is it. And I guess I will come back tomorrow and check in with you guys then. Okay. Have a great day. Bye. Hey guys, it's Saturday morning. I did not get a chance to sit down with my planner yesterday. Like I said, things have just been so crazy this week. So this is not a typical week. Typically I do sit down with it every day, but this week things have gotten away from me. So since it's Saturday and I need to post this after the pen video today, what I'm going to do is write in what happened yesterday, um, any plans I have today, and then I will fill out tomorrow as well. By the way, I am use, I am wearing, I know this looks really huge. <laughs> it's called the Comfy and my friend Elise gave it to me and it is so amazing. It's this giant sweatshirt. Have you ever heard of it? It's a giant. It's like really, really long and I can fit my, my legs in it. It's like a like just a really big oversized sweatshirt and it's cozy and great when it's cold outside. So not a sponsor. I'm just saying like I really like it. So, okay. So let's see. So yesterday I did go to that play. It was really good. And... Since there wasn't anything else that happened, I don't think what I'm trying to remember. Like I, when I have a blank space, I like to think what happened in that day and like, are there any memories I can jot down? Like weird things that happened or funny things or just interesting things, but nothing really happened yesterday besides, oh, well, Allie and Heather did clean the house really well and that, but I don't, I don't think I need to really write that down. Anyway, okay, so I'm gonna just put a little decoration there. And let's see, let me 
grab a few sticker books. I've got like a giant pile over here. Um, let me look at this Christmas book. How about a little quote? How about believe? I know that it is, or maybe peace, will that fit? No, because I don't want to put yellow there because like then it would be yellow and yellow, but I couldn't, I can't remember to use peace on another day. How about presents? The reason I didn't put believe in that I decided not to do that right now is because it's black and I really don't have any black in here aside from my writing. So I'm going to sort of keep it that way. So these presents are really big and I think I'll put them on Sunday because I'm not going to have a lot of things to write up here. So I'll just put those down. I'm going to put a little tree there on the side. And then I'll put a little something next to it. Maybe one of these little quotes. Um, I don't think I'm going to use the ho ho because I kind of want it because <laughs> I kind of want it to fill up more of that space and not just be a line across. So let me try this. I don't know if I'm going to like this, but it does carry it into Saturday. I probably shouldn't have put that tree there. Let me take the tree off. Maybe I'll put the tree on Saturday instead, but I'm going to. Actually, tree on Saturday would be good because we are getting a Christmas tree today. So that is not a bad idea. Put that there. And then I took those off because I'm kind of looking at the whole spread to see. That's what I do. I don't just focus on the day and put stickers down. I'm not like kind of like this what I'm doing is looking at the whole entire spread and thinking if I put this sticker down is it going to balance out what I've got going on on the other side of the page so I look at the big picture every time um, do I want the tree here or here I feel like I want it here and then I'm just gonna write in Christmas tree shopping or whatever. Oh no. Uh, I just realized I left my paper mate flare open. And when you leave your paper mate flare open, this is what happens. Well, that's it's been sitting there for a couple days, so so much for that. Um, but I have another one. Okay, so I'm just going to write bye, and I know we are super late at this Christmas tree shopping thing. Oh my goodness, we always get it a few weeks before Christmas, but time just got away from me this year, and so now I'm putting up a tree when it's almost Christmas. I hate doing that. I kind of messed that up there. I don't like doing that because then it's less time to enjoy it. It feels like a lot of work for just like a little amount of time, but we'll put, we'll keep it up until New Year's, but still. Bye. I hope there's some good trees even left. Christmas tree. And guess what guys skipped the gym again oh my goodness at least I'm being honest with you and not pretending I went I'm gonna leave this little space blank because I might get plants tonight a friend is talking about going out and I want to make sure that I leave a space in case I need to write that in okay so tomorrow I think all I'm doing tomorrow is working on YouTube and Christmas shopping so don't think I have other plans so I, I think it's safe to fill in this box at this point so there's something in here that says Christmas shopping I didn't see that 
unless they've already used it. Okay, I just remembered I do have something to put in this. So we are taking Bumble to see Santa Claus tomorrow at the PetSmart. <laughs> We've never done that. I've always wanted to do that. So I thought that would be really fun. So I'm going to write, take Bumble. I'll be curious to see how she acts because she loves people like loves all people I've never well there was one person once where she was a little bit hesitant but I other than that like I've never ever seen her not like a person so like she's always jumping in their lap and licking them and kissing them and I mean licking and kissing are the same thing when you're a dog honestly but you know what I mean so yeah I'll be curious to see how she acts with Santa Take Bumble to visit. We'll do Santa in big letters and I'm gonna do it um, like in italics. And then maybe I'll put a Santa sticker there. All right, so let's look at Santa stickers. Ho, ho, ho. This is big, but actually will be good right here. Maybe I should white that. Nah, I'm not gonna bother. Santa's crooked. Santa, what are you doing? All right, is that better? Yes, that's cute. Okay, so there are a few last minute Christmas things I have to do, so I'm gonna write them here and then we'll probably be done. Okay, uh, I do have this little area here, and I'm going to write finish Christmas shopping. Or should I write bake cookies? I've got to do both. Hoping I have enough time tomorrow to bake cookies. Yeah, let's do write bake cookies. That's more fun than writing Christmas shopping. So let me take this Pen here. This is a Pentel Energel 0.7. I don't know if I mentioned that earlier in the video. That's what I've been using for most of this like skinny writing over here. Up here, I think I used a 0.5. I need to get a new one because it's looking a little faded. But um, but this is a 0.7, and then the Papermate Flare obviously is just the regular Papermate Flare, and that's what I've been using for the bigger um, writing like that. So I'm going to write bake. So that just fills up that little space. I didn't have to do that because I knew I was going to bake cookies because I already wrote it up here. Um, but that just fills that up. So let me look and see what else I got done at the top, if anything. <laughs> um, oh my, my, my. Yeah. That's all I got. Oh man. I got a lot to do still. So. All right, well, I hope you liked this video. I, I, I know you guys like the the um, after the pens to see how I use my planner. Oh, oh, the random act of kindness. I forgot to check those off. So I did, I didn't do them all yet. I did leave a big tip. I did compliment someone. I did promote a planner, babe. And let's see, I did not pay for a stranger yet. I'd like to do that today. I did call a friend and I got these three things left to do so I will try to do those in the next couple days before Christmas so that's it from me I will see you on Monday and there will be a new big plan with me video on Monday I don't know yet if I'm gonna be able to get all the videos up that I had planned on my calendar for the next two weeks I'm trying 
but I'm really busy with Christmas and I was trying to get things done ahead of time so I could take Christmas week off and it just did not happen. So I may work a little bit next week, but I wanna try to spend some time with my family. So I don't know how many videos are gonna go out next week and the week after. So I'll do my best though and I will see you guys soon. Have a great day, bye.